BJ Kors here for the Hollywood Moment. We are here tonight in celebration of an incredible art opening. Tonight I'm here with... Rafi Antebi. Rafi, tell us a little bit about this art opening. It is just incredible and all the different mediums. I mean, I'm, I'm so excited and inspired by the spiritual feeling that's brought here tonight. Thank you so much. It's a, it's a journey that, uh, you know, all my life I did art, but uh, I never really opened up to become, uh, so to speak, artist to uh, paint and then share it with the world. But uh, I think I went through some motions in about three years ago where I decided I'm going to take time off and travel to the monasteries that I used to be a monk in, in, in Wudan and start there. Um, and that took me to different places around the world where uh, in Southeast Asia where I found different monks painting and I joined them. And I learned from the Tibetan monks, the mandalas, and then I went to Chiang Mai to study with the monk uh, the art of uh, charcoal powder and Myanmar and different places. And I wanted to bring to people the feeling of the simplicity and love that these people have to give. Herb, I mean, it's pretty exciting. This is a great, great gallery opening yeah, for Rob. I'm totally amazed. I mean, what he's accomplished in the last three years is absolutely amazing. On top of him being a black belt, he's like uh, fine focused on all these things. And he, he had showed me the early ones and, you know, few years back and little by little man he, he turned into like an, a major artist he's fantastic it's I'm speechless at some of this work yeah. and the different mediums from watercolors to portraits to, to bronze sculpture. to sculpture I mean it is pretty incredible yeah. you really took the gallery in is there a favorite medium or a favorite piece that just has captured your eyes um, there are a few but the thing that really captures me is the stories that are sparked right. by just looking at these beautiful paintings and photographs. Uh, they're alive, and they have a story to tell, right. and they tell it. And coming from a storyteller like yourself, it is so meaningful, is it not? It's so beautiful. I mean, he's so talented. And there's so many different forms that he's, he's doing. Right. He's, he's doing impressionism in the other room, realism in this room. It's all so, um, it's so moving right. and it's so impressive. But it's an innate talent that comes from his vision, from his love, from his awareness and love for people and interest for cultures, interest for beings, interest for people. And through that, his talent just goes through the roof. Well, like it he's draws done. you in every piece, whether it be a watercolor, a portrait, the multi-diversification of all the minerals, making the mandalas. I mean, yes. it is just eye-capturing. And you know, these mandalas take so much work to do, right. and how he uses all these different sands and colors and natural stones, and really natural, they're not right. colored extraordinary pieces. I, I really hope that he sells them, like he said, uh, or traditionally the monks would build, do them through a meditation and then throw them away. And I'm so grateful he didn't throw them away and he can share them with us and with the people and sell them. I think as a painter, I mean, it's outstanding how, as an actor, to, for me to see how he captures not just the aesthetic, how he captures the expression, the state of mind, the the culture of these people, the heart and soul of these people that tells you a lot about him as an artist, but it also brings us closer to where he went, to his journey. I believe that uh, the old always saying is uh, working for me. If you want to master the sword, you must first know the art of brush painting. I love it. I love it. And I've got to say, the patience from martial arts has got to resonate into the art that you bring to the sculpture and to the painting and to the mineral art. It's just incredible. Thank you so much. Rafi. Well, to learn more about Rafi's great works, once again, they can go to... It's at brushesandswords.com. Wonderful. And this is BJ Chorus Whip. Rafi Antebi. And this is The Hollywood Moment.